In this video, you will learn how to construct geometric figures and how to identify the figure being created from a given set of steps. Constructing figures using a compass and straight edge often uses congruent triangles to create figures with given characteristics. Let's look at how to construct a copy of an angle. Given an angle ABC and a ray QR, Jess will construct an angle PQR that is congruent to angle ABC. Which list of steps can be used to construct angle PQR? Here is a peek at the marks that are used for this construction. Remember, the construction starts with only angle ABC to be copied and ray QR, which will be a side of the angle to be constructed. The construction involves creating these two congruent triangles. Because the triangles are constructed as congruent, the angles at B and Q are also congruent. Start with angle ABC. One vertex of the triangle will be B. To locate the other two vertices, place the compass point on B and draw an arc that intersects the rays of the angle. This arc is shown in red in the figure. And the intersection points are labeled F and G. Next, without changing the compass width, place the compass point on point Q and draw a large arc that intersects ray QR. Label the intersection point H. Now place the compass point on point F and set the width to exactly the distance between F and G. Then without changing the compass width, place the compass point on point H and draw an arc that will intersect the previous arc drawn on the new figure. Label the intersection P. Finally, use a straight edge to draw ray QP as shown in blue on the image. Ray QP forms the remaining side of the angle PQR. Note that the distance from H to P is the same as the distance from F to G. Further, BG, BF, QP, and QH are all congruent because they are all radii of congruent circles. Because the side lengths in triangle BFG are the same as the side lengths in triangle QHP, the corresponding angles are also congruent. Therefore, angle ABC is congruent to angle PQR, and the construction of the congruent angle is complete. Now, let's look at another construction. This time, all the steps of the construction are given and you are asked to identify what figure was constructed. Starting with line segment AB, the following steps are completed. Which figure is constructed? Sketch out the construction to see what the result is. The first two steps describe drawing a line CD intersecting AB as shown in red. Then, the next few steps shown in blue and green are used to copy an angle, as seen in the previous problem. Because these two angles are congruent and corresponding, AB is parallel to CH. So these steps result in the construction of a line parallel to AB. Choice B is correct. Now you know more about how to construct geometric figures and how to identify the figure being created from a given set of steps. See you next time.